Global sourcing has started around 20 to 30 years ago, but it's across the seas. And so you have to have people going into these different places to make sure that it's produced in the right quality, with the right social standards, with the right environmental standards. When you talk about real transparency, you can not only talk about quality, you need to talk about who is producing that specific product. So in this case, it's talking about the factory, the manufacturing facility. Consumers are becoming more and more wary of how it's produced, and there hasn't been the means for these different stakeholders to really give that information into the consumer's hands, but more importantly also for them to be able to control that. The majority of activities for quality control today do only final random inspections. The majority of cases, 74% the processes are manual. It's very reactive. What is happening is that if you have a problem, you're not going to be able to identify it until that product is going to go into the market. Almost 10% of the sales that brands and retailers are having, especially on apparel and footwear, are returns. Sometimes you're catching a defect when already 80 to 90% of your products are already produced. And you have to ship, and sometimes it's hundreds of thousands of dollars of an order. Just imagine all that level of inefficiency and waste. It's an industry that hasn't evolved, where information is very hard to flow, information is stored in a lot of data silos, and therefore there's nothing you can do with that information to make you drive better business decisions. So it's incredible to see how massive brands that we know today still have that information just sitting in piles of paper. The world is changing. We need to bring technology to this business. And that's how we started Inspectorio. Site is our digital platform. It allows factories, suppliers, brands and retailers, third-party inspection agencies all to collaborate and operate in one single platform to run all of their quality programs. We want to make it as simple as possible. The brand or retailer is able to define the workflow or what inspection sequence that they have to follow. So then it doesn't matter who performs inspection. It could be the factory, it could be the vendor, it could be the third-party inspection company, or it could be their own team of inspectors. The system automatically assigns the inspectors, the standards, the rules that need to be applied so that a human being doesn't have to do that for every case. And then that data flows directly into the inspector's phone and through a mobile application executes the inspection. When I go to the factory, I just like open the app and I check how many assignments I need to do in a day. And this saves a lot of time for me. Instead of a lot of paper with like long text, I just take a look in the app. Every information already stated in the app. I just follow like step by step. So for example, when I find some defect, I just tap on the item, I select the item that has the defect, I take the pictures of that defect, and the information is in real time added to the inspection. And also, my manager, uh, every stakeholder can see it on the web. We automate all of the processes from booking the inspections, executing the inspections, generating reports, monitoring. We have real-time supervision of the inspection execution, so you can be in whatever other site in the world and you can be uh, visualizing what is happening, you know, in an inspection process that is taking place in China, in Vietnam, in Bangladesh. During the time in the past where we still fall into manual reports, people may think that whether our uh, reporting are fake or whether it's true, people can cheat on it no transparencies, and there's also like delay on the times. But now with Inspectorio, once they finish the inspections, they can quickly generate and input it into the apps and we can see the result immediately. I think Inspectorio is the best solutions that we can find so far in terms of transparency, where our uh, vendor, our head office can feel each factory performance wherever they are. So with these informations, it is giving us more effective times of finding improvements in terms of producing a good quality products rather than spending more time in analyzing the data and information. Since everybody's using the same operating system, all the data goes into one platform, one system, and then is the magical secret sauce is what happened with the data. So of course, not only easy access, but more importantly, we have powerful machine learning algorithms right at the center. You're capturing many, many different data points. 
When you start understanding patterns and you already have the insights, it's a question of saying, how can we then start learning earlier and start predicting and start prescribing? And when you start doing that, that's when you start generating savings, that's when you start becoming more preventative rather than reactive. We have a very strong philosophy on Inspectorio that if we're gonna build a world-class product, we need to have a world-class team. And we have a world-class data science team. Rise is our second uh, product. It's our compliance and sustainability platform for continuous improvement at the facility level. When uh, you talk about responsible sourcing, it's not only a matter of quality. It's also a matter of being able to get access of information on how that specific product was produced. So in Rise, you can pull that data in, or you can also configure your own internal sustainability audit programs. So now, look at Inspectorio being able to capture information throughout that whole process, quality and sustainability. We're capturing all of the data and the story, the history, the journey of that product. So the real impact to the world is that for the first time, we're gonna be able to tell consumers what's the history behind the products that they buy. And our vision is ultimately to be able to allow consumers, when they go into a shop, Take that QR code or take that scanner and you'll access all of that history. I think we're at a unique time where brands and retailers are recognizing more than ever the importance of shifting their traditional methods to more digital, modern networks. And we are also in a time where we've built a product that has all of these capabilities and solves the problems of the industry. We are leading the transformation. We're bringing all the, the top brands and retailers all around the world, the top vendors, the top factories into one platform, one system, one operating system. So really, the evolution of our product is thanks to the hundreds of years of experience, of collective experience of all of these users that are starting to operate the platform. Because talking about machine learning capabilities, talking about data scientists on the quality and sustainability and continuous improvement in the retail industry, nobody bring that topic before. We were the first one, and we are the ones that are bringing light through the power of a data-driven approach. It's what's happened in almost all industries. It's just that in this one, it's taking time. Um, and that's why we're here. <laughs>